Hi guys, it's Mina. Welcome back. Uh, Happy New Year. <laughs> We're going to do a fun little pour today. I love New Year's. I, I think it's a great time for new beginnings and to, to start things that you've been wanting to do for a while. And it's always just a very bright, sunshiny time. It's also my birthday is January 6th, so that's always fun. But uh, in honor of that light, happy, bright feeling, I wanted to do a painting with some very bright colors. So my colors today are, I'm going to move that out of the way. I have DecoArt Americana Decor Satin Enamels in white mixed with Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White. Great color. I have two cups of that. I have one is a little thinner for my base coat. I have Liquitex Basics Cadmium Yellow. My paints are a little thick today. I might thin them out just a touch more. That's Cadmium Yellow. I also have Liquitex Basics Cadmium Orange, which is looking a little pink after the flow troll, but we'll come back to being orange. <laughs> I also have another great color today. This one is Golden's Nickel Azo Gold. And it's one of their fluid acrylics. So I mixed it with my Liquitex Gloss Medium and Varnish. And it was still a little thin, so I have actually added a dollop of Elmer's Glue All to thicken it up and bring it closer to the consistency of everything else where it's leaving a mound on a mound. As you see. Okay, we also have Decor Americana Decor Metallics in 24 Karat Gold. Funny with that light on it looks like it's soft gold but this is a 24 karat <laughs> and last but not least we have golden's deep turquoise halo so i was thinking about using this as a base coat the turquoise color but i really want to do one of those kind of backwards pours like in the two-step stretch i want to do one of those two-step stretch ones where i kind of pour it backwards but i'm not going to go across the top i'm kind of going to do like I did in Space Feathers and kind of move around a little bit like a wandering ring pour. So we're going to start off with a good amount of white in the bottom. This is actually warm white, not just pure white. Um, and then I'm going to add some turquoise. Okay, and then we're going to go back to the white again because if I put the, the gold next to the turquoise, we're going to get a lot of green. I don't want green. Okay, so now we're gonna put our gold in. And this actually sets the stage beautifully for transitioning into the warmer colors. So that, that layer of white between the turquoise and the gold is very helpful. A little bit of yellow, a little bit of orange, a little bit of gold again. Nickel Azo Gold. Pretty color. I'm going to go into the little bit of white against that. We're going to go back to turquoise again. A thicker layer of white. That's luck, huh? Been totally quiet here all day. The second we start shooting, the guy with the leaf blower shows up. <laughs> it's so windy outside. I was gonna pour outside, but it's going like 30, 40 mile an hour winds, so not happening today. But that's okay. Nice and cozy in here. I love my little tough shed. It's been very good to me. A nice, safe, comfy place stay out of the wind, stay out of the rain, still be able to plant. Awesome. Enough room to dry stuff. <laughs> Enough room to sit on the floor and paint if I want to. Which is pretty awesome. So, okay. A bit more of the turquoise there. And we're going to go in a little more gold. Now, just because this is the outside layer, it's not going to matter as much. We're going to go white again. Okay, so there's our cup. This is going to be good. Okay, I'm going to check on this other white that I have that's a little thinner than that stuff. I have two sticks in it, so I knew which one was which. It's a bit thick. Little 
little too much water in there. <laughs> it auto corrected. I'll clean that up in a second. Let's put this on. Okay, let's pour this puppy. Let's do this nice happy pour. Put a little bit more white on top. Okay. There we go. And we're gonna pour this backwards again. <sighs> All right. I'm not gonna stress about that. I'm about to put a whole bunch of paint on there. Here we go. That's pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna go that way first.
cool. I really like the colors in this one. That nickel as a gold when it mixes with the, the regular gold is just so pretty. Like my hands are all green. <laughs> it's the turquoise. Okay, that's pretty neat. So we still have some paint left, a lot of paint left. So we're going to do one more canvas. I'm not going to torch it because I don't want 10 million more cells to come up. And it will be okay. Well, maybe I'll just torch it real fast. My little torch. But when you torch it, you do tend to get those little tiny white cells everywhere, which I'm not a big fan of, so. Okay. Leave that there. We clean off the edges, and then we will pour another one. That was really fun. one back here. Just like that. And we will do the other one. Thank you, dear. These are 18 by 24 inch gallery wrapped canvases. same cup we were using before and some more of our colors. I'm going to start with some white at the bottom. I probably should have mixed up more white. I'm going to do more turquoise. Clear turquoise. I'm going to use some of the white that I was using for my base coat even though it's just a little thinner because the other one's empty now. And we're going to go with that nickel as a gold because that was really pretty with the gold. Good. So that's cool. Alright, since we don't have a whole huge bunch of white this time, I'm not going to put down a base coat. I am going to pour a little puddle of gold. I'm going to put some on the corners too. Just kind of around the perimeter. Because we like it when gold sells up. That's really cool and pretty. this out on the edges and corners.
before this. Spread that out too because I'm not going in a circle. <laughs> All right. All right, let's do this. Okay, that's pretty cool. Um, let's see. Yeah. All right, I'm just gonna go for it. Let's see how we do. So there we go, that's pretty cool. I like that. Clean up the side of it. That's pretty cool. So that's cool. I like that. I like that a lot, actually. I think it's really neat. It's really pretty. I love this top section with the with the orange, the Nicolazzo gold. It's really pretty with the white. So I think I'm going to take some of that bottom section off. It's a little too busy, and I'm enjoying the simpler, pretty lines of the top section. We're going to leave that one there. So, so I'm going to pull them out and both out so we can look at them next to each other. Move that over.
there's our New Year's Day pour. And uh, like I said, I really wanted something bright and happy and positive. I really like both of these. I think it turned out really cool. Can you see both of them in the frame? Usually you can zoom in a little bit. And then if you want, hand me the camera. Okay, so I've just taken the camera down. I'm going to take you in for some close-ups. These turned out really cool. I really like that a lot. Very happy and bright. Which is exactly what I wanted. So... Starting here in the corner. I like this very cloud, puffy cloud. Like this beautiful line in the middle. Oh, look at this. I love this section. I love all these little cells coming up. It's so pretty. This is really cool, too. I love these type of, this is beautiful, very happy. I think it's so important to maintain a positive attitude. You know, life always doesn't go exactly how we want. That's a given, you know. You know what we tell our daughters is how you handle it when it doesn't go how you want. You know? Keep going. Try again. <laughs> and this one's really cool. I like this a lot. I love those long lines. Very pretty. I can hear the hawks outside. You can get all the way over there. Yes. Very cool. That corner. It's really neat in there. You see the the orange and the yellow coming through the turquoise. I love this section up here. That's so pretty. Okay, well, that's it for this one. I will show you when they are dry. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys, and Happy New Year! Okay, so this is probably about an hour later, and I was looking at them and looking at them, and there were some things that I really liked, and there were some things that I didn't really like. So, one of the things I didn't like was that big, puffy cloud formation that was here along this edge. So I tilted it off and these beautiful, beautiful, beautiful cells opened up. I just, I'm in love with this corner and this whole section is just so pretty to me. Right in here with all these little tiny cells popping up. Cute. So pretty. So I really like this. It's so gorgeous. Look at that. <laughs> is it in focus? I hope it's in focus. <laughs> Really cool stuff and in here. There's all these little teeny tiny cells along this like turquoise seam almost. I did go through with my stick in some parts that I wanted to like stretch out the tips a little bit. I like it better like that. I like it flowing more rather than some big rounded weird object. So that's that one where I tilted off that one side. And on this one, I really like this piece a lot. It's so pretty to me. I love these cells in here. It's just gorgeous. Now there's that like the really deep turquoise underneath and all this is sort of floating on top of that. It's so cool. This is really cool. I did tilt off a little bit of this side over here because I wanted to open this up a little bit more. And I'm glad that I did because that, that deep turquoise is like really dark right there. It's really pretty. And then there's this part. It's so gorgeous. Look at this. 
in this corner. I love it. So cute. And this part just, oh, I love it. Beautiful. So, anyways, I'm not messing with them anymore, <laughs> but I wanted to show you what I did, so it wasn't a surprise at the end when they were a little different. Anyways, Happy New Year. I'll see you when they're dry. Okay, so it's not dry yet. <laughs> Neither one of them are, but I wanted to show you they're starting to dry, but they came out so cool. I really like these two. Beautiful, beautiful colors in here. I showed you guys all this before, so. But it's drying beautifully. Very pretty colors coming through. That Nicolazzo gold is amazing, especially with the 24 karat gold. Okay, let me show you the other one. Okay, I really like these two. This one came out so neat. Really beautiful parts in here. This is just gorgeous. I'm glad I tilted that edge off because there's a lot of white in here. It's kind of neat with this really dark seam. Beautiful. It's showing up really blue, but it's actually very turquoise. I don't know why it's not picking up the true color. But So, Happy New Year, guys. I hope you guys have a beautiful year full of everything that you want and you've been dreaming of and the means to make it happen and lots of good health and happiness and love and always light see the light be the light share the light <laughs> happy new year guys i'll see you soon bye bye